Alrighty guys, welcome back for another Locker Code video. So, a couple of updates. I, as I mentioned, am working full time. And I'm trying to find the right balance between working full time and working part time and content creation. And with the holiday season going on, I want to make sure that I'm dedicating that time to my family, but also at the same time, dedicating time to balance content creation and actually being a lot more consistent with YouTube and setting goals and striving to really take this channel to the next level. Um, but it's really hard trying to find the right balance between content creation, family time, working. It's it, it can be definitely overwhelming, but I am still trying to find the balance for that. And I definitely appreciate you guys being so patient. So I took some time to find and kind of did a little bit of soul searching to figure out why I was kind of stuck when it came to content creation. Like I was recording content, I had content ready, but when it came down to the actual editing portion of it, I just was lacking a lot of motivation and I was trying to figure out what truly was a root cause for this and And I realized that I was just very hesitant. Um, a lot of questioning, a lot of my content, I was wondering, is this content even good? Um, am I setting these really high expectations and standards for myself that I'm acting like what these partnered and verified YouTubers should be doing? And honestly, it just really got to the point where I was just so overwhelmed that I just froze. I did I I did nothing. And I like I days were going by and I I just couldn't do it. And I it took me a lot to really to really get me out of that. You know, I have to remind myself I'm not a professional video editor. I'm not a professional thumbnail artist. I am heaven. I am doing the absolute best that I can. I'm not at that point financially where I can afford, you know, or I'm making money from my YouTube channel to be able to afford to have a consistent video editor, a consistent thumbnail artist. But with that being said, let's get into these locker codes, guys. All right. So the first locker code that we are going to be doing is Retro 2K Volume one and this locker code came out on December 8th. All right, let's hopefully we can maybe get some token. No, no tokens. Okay, we're just straight to the pack. No extra. No, oh, oh. No way. Okay, I was gonna say, I was like, please don't drop down. Awesome. So we got the Retro 2K pack, which I think is actually pretty cool. And the next locker code we're going to be doing is Tatum and Taco. I think that's how you. That. This locker code came out on December 22nd. Okay, so we've gotten Devin. I believe we got Walter Davis. So I actually would love to try to get a... Uh, probably Joel and B. Or Jason. Oh! Oh, come on. It's going to give us another Devin. Oh, 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 oh. Oh my god. Oh, oh my god. This poor ball. 
There we go. All right, we got Jewel. That's one of the packs we wanted. I'm super, super excited. Cool, cool beans. All right, so the last locker code that we will be doing is the NBA is back. And Okay, so we already have Jaw, so we don't really want that. So hopefully we can get the diamond consumable. Oh my god, we're gonna get another Jaw. <laughs> As you guys can see, I am at a level 8. I will also be uploading that My Team content. Um, but like I was discussing previously, um, once I do get my new cam, all my new additions to my setup, um, we'll be getting a lot more of cam, like with cam content. Hopefully I can make time to start live streaming again. That was really fun. But that's going to wrap up this video, guys. Thank you so much for watching. Make sure to like, comment, and subscribe. And I'll see you guys next time. Have a good night. And remember, stay safe, guys. Stay safe. Bye.